What is up, guys? Today is October 30th, 2011. If we took a, take a look at the date I joined on YouTube, October 30th, 2010. It's the one year anniversary of my YouTube channel since I started making YouTube videos. So, for those of you who kind of stuck with me for that long, if we still remember, let's go back to here. Um, this is the first video I posted on Cricket Keeping Part 1. It's a four minute video, well, a little over four minutes, and um, I didn't get too many views on it, and neither do most of my videos, but that's pretty much it. And um, this is like my first video, and um, if you don't remember, it's me keeping crickets and being silly and saying random stuff, and I still do that today. But since it's the one year anniversary, well, let's just say we're going to have some fun today. And uh, we're going to have a somewhat moderately long video um, to remember what we have been through. So that's the first video. Since today is so such a special day, we might as well do something that's a little bit more special than usual. And um, that is we're going to go through most of the stuff in my collection of insects that are living, not the dead collection, because that's that's just boring. <laughs> Anyways, let's move on. Um, this is pretty much most of the stuff I have, minus a few, I think. So let's get started. Um, only got a few more minutes, and um, I guess I'll do it. I'll just start. Uh, let's start with um, this one. This is the one of the grass spiders in H. Lenopsis pennsylvanica, and this is one of them that laid the egg sac, laid an egg sac. Sacks right there. This is what I've been calling the queen, um, so I guess I might just end up calling it the queen. But she's a very beautiful female, and you've seen her in, I think, a couple of my videos. But there she is, nice and beautiful, in all her glory. And that's number one. Okay, let's move on. Number two. Uh, let's go to this one. This here is... Oh, it just scampered now. It's another Age Lenopsis Pennsylvanica, another AP. And uh, this is also a grass spider, same species as the queen. I don't have a name for her yet, but she also laid an egg sac right here, and you saw that on one of my videos as well, so that she's pretty cool. The meanest, though, is still the queen. The queen is definitely the meanest. Uh, let's do this one. This one you've probably seen quite a few times. This is another A. Pennsylvanica, and she laid two egg sacs, which is really awesome. But, um, there she is right there. She's not my biggest... Oh, she caught her fly. That's wonderful. Or is that a cricket? No, it's a fly. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm just... Yeah, I'm just going on. Um, but this is... This is one of the Pennsylvanicas we have again, so this is pretty cool. Okay, let's see. This right here is... Another Pennsylvanica. I'm actually selling this one for four bucks. See who buys it. But this is another female I found. She's a smaller female, and I don't even know where she is. Oh, there she is, right there. But yeah, I have a lot of Pennsylvanicas, as you know, because they make such great pets. This is a male uh, grass spider Pennsylvanica that I have. AP, same species as the two female. Oh, there he goes. But you can tell he's a male by those giant pedipulps at the front, which are like little hands. He only has six legs. He's got four on one side and two on the other side because um, that female right there got him while I tried to breed them. Okay, okie dokie. Let's move on. All right. Here, this one is a centipede. It's a Scolopendrid species, but I never show this one all too much. I don't even think, this is like the first time I showed him, because um, he's never seen, like, I never see him anyways. That's him. Oh, by the way, this is also my 300 video. I forgot to mention that. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, let's see, who else did we see? Haven't seen. We saw this one. Oh, we didn't see this one. This is the... Uh, that one wolf spider that I have, as you can see, it's quite an ab, like elaborate at digging and burrowing. But you can see the abdomen and the legs right there. There she is. She's growing really fast. She molted quite a few times in my care. 
Um, I guess we'll just do this one. This one is the, I moved the giant male. Uh, I thought she was a female at first, but it's a he. Yeah, she's a he. Whatever. That's not funny. Um, let's move on. There it is. It's in the burrow. Let's try to get it out. Come here, boy. Come on. We want to see you. There you go. This is the seven-legged male that I um, featured quite a few times. He's pretty cool. And he's kind of mean. Yeah, there he is. Nice looking male. Alright, I might have to cut this into two parts because I don't want to upload a 10 minute video. I guess I might, but we'll see about it. There he goes, right there. Um, I guess we'll just do this one down here. This is a uh, another Pennsylvania grass spider. She built quite an elaborate little thing right here. I originally did not have dirt in here, if you guys don't remember, or if you might remember. But, yeah, we'll just keep it like this. I don't want to open it too much. But she has two egg sacs right there, and there she is. And I just put in some dirt to make it look nice. And this is the only one where I put in a water dish. Um, I really don't like to give these guys water dishes because they always like web it up and mess everything so that's a rarity okay let's see this is a this is a female um, Rabidosa Rabida oh, I can't even pronounce it Rabidosa Rabida um, the rabid wolf spider a friend of mine gave it to me she's pretty cool she's really nice too she never bites or tries to bite for that matter Okay, there she goes. And um, we'll just do this one. This is another grass spider. I have lots of grass spiders. This one has not laid a sack yet, but there she is right there. As you can see, she's pretty fat. I featured her quite a few times too. This is the first wolf, uh, grass spider that I got this year. And my camera is running low on memory, so let me um, split this up to part two. All right, guys, stay tuned for part two.